everyone, this is Zonta with Paper Products. Today's video is on what's new in Revit 2023, and in particular, the new measuring functionality in a 3D view. Here I am in Revit 2023. I have a 3D view open, and if I want to measure, I can head over to the Applications Toolbar, Quick Access Toolbar up here, and their measuring commands are here. If I click the little black arrow, I can choose one or the other. I'm going to click measure between two references, and I can pick any point that I want, say for example here to here, and it measures it as 27 feet 6 inches. I can also put a check mark for chain, and I can run a string of dimensions as well, say from here to here to here, and it gives me total length in the options too far saying 33 feet. Now the minute you move your mouse though, it still assumes you're trying to measure Additionally, if I were to hit enter, um, then it goes back to the default of not measuring anything. If I want to measure, say, the vertical distance from this point straight down to perpendicular to this plane, I can click this point with the control key down and then touch the face that I want, and it will give me that measurement as being 39 feet, 0 inches. Okay? Now, there is nothing in regards to right-click capability to set those measuring dimensions as permanent 2D dimensions. Um, I always get that question a lot when I'm teaching and showing this information to students. They always want to know, well, can I measure and then leave those dimensions that are measured as physical 2D dimensions? I don't have to worry about doing it later. Um, just can't do that yet. Okay. And then the only other question I ever got was, is this command, measuring command, anywhere else in the software? And as far as I can tell, it doesn't look like it's anywhere else still. So typically I would want to see it either in the Annotate tab, which I don't see it, or in the Management tab, which I don't see either. So just remember, you have your measuring tools in the up here in the Quick Access Toolbar, okay? And you can measure that information now in 3D. Thank you very much for watching, and as usual, let me know if you need anything. Thank you.